So in this video, I want to go over a problem from the uh, Mind Calendars homework assignment of Tolkien and Hobb. And I'm going to look at number seven. So it's on the second page. Um, we are given the creation date. The Mayans set their creation date at four Ahau in the Tolkien calendar and eight Kuku in the Hobb calendar. So I'm going to look at number seven. What is the Hobb date the next time after creation that the Tolkien date is four Paper, and I got uh, the creation date written down for a how for Tolkien and eight kunku for Hob. And we want to know what is the Hob date when it's for a how again. Just another way to think about that question. So when the Tolkien calendar cycles back on itself, that will be for a how again. So this is. 260 days. The Tolkien calendar is 260 days, so we're looking at what is the Hob date going to be from the creation date of Eight Kunku in 265 days. So if you remember, we would take the number of days, 260, and divide that by 365, but of course that's zero. 365 doesn't go into 260, and the remainder is 260 days. All right, so that's what we're looking at. We need to go through the calendar, 260 days. Uh, I've got a printout here, and I like to put a note. Okay, today, or the creation date we're moving forward is 8 Kunku, right here on the uh, Hob calendar. And notice I need to move down this calendar three, or excuse me, 260 days. So that means I'm going to go through Yeb. Don't forget, all of these months have 20 days, except Yeb. Yeb is the weird one. I'll put a little star next to it just to remember. Okay, Yeb is that weird five-day month um, in the Hob calendar. So if we move down through the calendar and cycle back up to the new year, one or zero pop, then we're going to go through Yeb. So I'm going to go back here to my scratch work, and I'm going to subtract five days. And this is taking into account the fact that we're going to go through that strange five-day month. So we're going to have 255 days. So what that does is if we just skip those five days, then we're going to be able to skip YM when we count this up and just move directly to pop, wo, sip, so it's etc. So now I want to take 255 days, and I want to convert that into months. So I'm going to divide this by 20. So if we divide this by 20, I think that's going to be 12. It is. So we have 12, and 12 times 20 is 240. Subtract, I get 15. So I put little notes right here. We've got 12 months. Again, that 12 months is not counting YM. And then we have 15 days left over. So if we just look at the months, let's get that in there underneath here. I'm going to go back to the counter and I want to count um, 12 months. Again, from 8 Kunku. We're going to skip YM. Don't forget, we're skipping because we subtracted these five days up here. So 8 Kunku. So Count them off. I got pop is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So, okay. So, if I just take 12 months, that's going to lead me to 8. Okay. All right. So, that's well and good. We've moved 12 months, but I still have this 15 days down here. So, I got 15 days, so I need to then tack on plus 15 days. So 8 plus 15, you know, this pure arithmetic would be 23. But don't forget, all of these months in the hop calendar are 20 days. So days are numbered either 1 to 20 or 0 to 19. But the main thing is 20 days per month. So we've actually gone to the next month. So I'll just put a little on to the next month, which is on the calendar. Mock. 
And since we each month is 20 days, I'm going to take away 20. You know, 18 if you uh, basically count up to 20 from here. We're going to have three days left over. So the final answer here is three muck.